This robot could deliver your food to you in a few months. It will be programmed to travel about a kilometer on footpaths from Westgate Mall to offices in JTC Summit. It will navigate traffic lights and even take the lifts while testing out different weather and light conditions. Testing will be done to ensure safety. It's the latest autonomous vehicle trial to take place in Singapore. Also in the pipeline is this skin patch to improve road safety. It's able to monitor a driver's substance levels, such as glucose, alcohol and drugs. Dangyang Technological University's newest lab has 16 projects in the pipeline. It looks into smart mobility and delivery, artificial intelligence, and smart materials and communication technologies. Continental says some products could reach the market in two to three years. When it comes then to a real product, yeah, it's together with a customer of us, a car manufacturer. They give us a specification how the display should look like and how the display has a feel and touch. And we then use this technology we de developed here to reach this feel and touch, to enable us to fulfill the specification. About 90 researchers and 80 students at NTU will work on these innovations. Bringing these these talents together in unique ways is a lot better than either the industry working by itself because they can tap into the talent of dozens of our PhD students and likewise it's wonderful for our students because they know what the real life applications are, how industry works. The lab is aiming for more than 20 patent applications and awards in the next five years.